Courtney and it is a semi-final match tonight. Um, it's the first leg of Liverpool against Arsenal in the Carabao Cup. I'm so excited. I don't think I've ever been to a semi-final, so this is a first for me. Um, really excited. I'm sat in the lower Kenny today and I'm running late at the minute, hence why I'm talking quite fast. Um, so I'm going to try and run over to Taggy's and catch a bit of Jamie. I might also pop into Hotel Anfield next door um, and I'll head in. But yeah, really excited for today. I think there's going to be a bit of a coach meet and greet, so I'm going to try and sort of catch that. I've got a lot that I want to catch and very little time to do it. Um, not sure on team news today again. Bit of a weird one. Um, Trent and Alison are back in training, but it depends how that goes. Um, yeah. Really excited. If we win this, it puts us on a good route for getting to Wembley. But we just have to see how it goes. Again, fingers crossed as always that we absolutely smash them because it's what we need. So I'm going to go to Taggy's, see if I can catch Jamie, see if I can catch the coach. I'm popping the hotel and field, so see us all there. So we 
have team news. Alison and Trent are back in the squad after having COVID. So happy. That's good news. Then we've got Matter, Van Dyke, Robertson. Robertson, I'm really shocked at because where was after the match the other day? You could see after he went off when he's got a slight knock, he was in a like, bit of pain and wasn't happy. So I thought Klopp might have rested him, but it's good news that he's not got a knock or anything that he's carrying. Then we've got Fabinho, Henderson, Milner, Jota, Minamino and Firmino. So really the front three is the only front three we could have had. Like that is actually made up of people who want to play in the front three. Um, yeah, I am shocked that Henderson and Milner are both playing at the same time. But really strong sellers. Um, bench is pretty strong for, if you think, most of our best players off at AFCON at the minute. Um, but yeah, decent size. I'm about to go in now. Um, yeah, let's just hope we smash it.
Nil nil. Um, front three didn't really do much. I don't know if they had the shot on target. 
Barely, barely annoyed me how they were just pointless shots, like no way could have just taken it over. Um, yeah, Ali being an absolute madman coming all the way out. Matter being the most attacking player on the pitch. It's just been one of them really weird games, but it just proves the point at the minute that if we play a team that goes down to 10 men, it could, we completely drop out the game, and I don't know why that is. It should work in our advantage, but it absolutely doesn't. Um, yeah. So, on to the next leg next week. Fingers crossed, we just absolutely bossed that game and we go at Wembley. Um, but yeah, it still goes on. Absolutely drawless. So, got let this is the first leg, got the second leg next week. And then we find out if we're going to Wembley or not. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's a bit nervous. Um, I'm just sort of rambling now because I'm like, but yeah, think. Trent and Robbo had pretty poor games when it came to crosses and corners. Um, but yeah. They, Arsenal's goalkeeper, in all fairness, was decent when it came to saves. Really annoying because the time wasted. But made decent saves at times. Um, even if they weren't on target, they were decent. So, that being said, I am off because it's late and I'm tired. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.